Congratulations to Kelly Rowland. No. Why you saying no? <laughs> Who shot my baby club up? <laughs> she's married. Her, her husband? Oh, I forgot she's Tim married. Tim Witherspoon. They got married lucky, last lucky month man. in Costa Rica. Round of applause to that man, y'all. Jesus Christ. You get to hit Kelly Rowland raw and shoot her club up. You, you lie right with me. She actually uh, posted a photo of some Air Jordan sneakers with a small baby pair on her social media and then she wrote, I'll be stunting like my daddy. Nice. Maybe she just bought Blue blue Ivy some Jordans. Shut up. How do we know that means she's pregnant? That could be it, but I don't think so. Yeah, she's having a baby. Congratulations, Kelly Rowland. That's beautiful. And I told you I saw her when I was in the club in Houston and she said, I'm, that's when I met her husband. He was her fiance at the time. And she said, he's like my Amex card. I don't leave home without him. Well, Kelly, That's you're cute. still, even though you're married, you're still on my list of women who... who you can't do that! I, I would like to suck a fart out your butt. And um, pregnant women are very gassy, so I'm here for you if you need me. Anyway, you have to take women who are married off that list. J-Lo's available now, though. She wasn't ever married. I know what I'm saying. She's, yes, she was. She not to Casper Smart. Well, not to Casper Smart, but oh. she's been married before. Hey, ain't nobody thinking about Mark Anthony. Mark Anthony looked like a... X-ray of a skeleton. Goodness anyway, face. Stevie J owes over a million dollars in back child support. He's in jail now for that. He's probably going to bail out soon. But he was supposed to pay $6,600 a month at first, and then that was raised to $8,500. He stopped paying in 2001 and hasn't paid a penny since then. I don't know if he thought it was just going to go away. He probably did. How do people just not pay money that they owe? They think it's just going to disappear? I have no remorse for Stevie J. Keep his ass locked up. You knew he was supposed to pay child support payments. All right, and congratulations to Pharrell. He returned to his high school in Virginia Beach. He was supporting his From One Hand to Another initiative, and during that ceremony, he was also honored with the key to the city. Congratulations to Pharrell. Here is part of the ceremony. Today, June 7th, 2014, is Pharrell Williams Day. It is my honor to present Pharrell Williams, the key to the city of Virginia Beach, stating, you make us proud and happy. FYI, Pharrell avoids the Breakfast Club at all costs, okay? He called up here one time. He called here one time, but he comes to this building quite often and never even thinks about coming to this show. It's, he was here last week. It's funny, you know, you, but you tell people to do that. You say, forget all that ish, ish and stay on the pop side. And then when they do it, you, you, you call you them out You criticize them. What they I, got to do uh, listen, I'm going to work on club. getting Pharrell up here. Uh, he's doing we the pop play, stuff. We, we don't play the music anyway. I just want to talk to him. No. What are you talking about? But you tell people to avoid the ish. But we play Mood That Dope. Move that dough. Move that dough. That's to do with the music. That has nothing to do with interviewing. What okay. are you talking about? Now, let's talk about Chief Keef. He got kicked out of his apartment. He got evicted in Chicago because he was not paying rent. He owed four months rent. That totaled almost $12,000. And he doesn't seem upset about it. He actually posted an Instagram video and said that he was looking for houses. So, I guess he just doesn't care. He got evicted. Just not paying the bills. I don't understand why people just don't pay their bills. I don't understand why somebody would rent the Chief Keef. I don't know how it, yeah. I, I think he's going to buy a house I now. can't think of not one good reason to rent the Chief Keef. Well, Keith. the guy said he was a good tenant, though. If there's one person that you should discriminate he's against. He's probably never home. It's Chief Keef. Okay. Uh, all right, well, that is your rumor report. I'm